and everywhere, the stamping foot of the boogie piano player sets the tempo for nimble feet that dance the jitterbug. Winner of more than a hundred rug cutting contests is Arthur Walsh, top flight Hepcat. The dance these kids are doing is strictly modern, yet many swing steps come from dances of long ago. For instance, the quick stop. That movement started way back in the days when men were men, even if they did wear lace cuffs and fancy pants. It went like this. It was called the curtsy. The gay old waltz has also contributed steps to the jitterbug of today. Ah, oh, yes, how I used to do this step before my joints began to creak. And here, the same footwork stepped up into jitterbug tempo. Yes, even the ballet adds its bit, and I'll battle any ballerina who denies it. The pirouette. And do they pirouette in jive joints? Sure, like this. Hello, a bit of the old Javanese dance. Cute, eh? Yep, you'll find this in the jitterbug, too. You just dislocate your dream box, bud. This is called pecking. And this, well, name it and you can have it. And he wonders why he gets headaches. Ah, but not all swing steps are taken from ancient heel and toery. Many movements are quite original, including some that have come about by accident. For instance, the Boogie Woogie was born when a couple of hepcats got off the beam. Ouch. By way of laughing it off, the guy got the idea of walking back to his partner in jive tempo. The chick got off a rusty dusty, and the Boogie Woogie was born. Now separating, they worked out many variations of approaching each other, including this one. It's called the Hesitation Shorty George. Solid, Papa. And now, folks, so that you too may learn to hit that jive, let me give you a simple explanation of jitterbug fundamentals. We've dressed the kids so that you may easily see the basic movements of the dance. The boy's right hand is sometimes placed here which, of course, is why we placed a mark here. But the girl's foot should never be placed here. Simple. And now, the basic step. It's easy to follow and goes like this. Girl left, white one. Boy right, black one. Girl white, black two. A boy black, white girl, boy brown, black. Oh, well, you see how it goes. Having learned the basic steps, you now forget them completely. To be a hepcat, you've got to practice plenty. You practice that shoulder stuff. And you make with the toes. Again, please. Thank you. Then you swing the wing and whip the hip. Yeah. While facial expressions are always dignified. And now, dear pupils, to completely clarify this dance, we will trace on the floor the simple symmetrical pattern formed by the graceful feet of the jitterbugs. That explains everything. However, my friends, as you will observe, there is more to this torso-tossing technique than mere Terpsichorean pyrotechnics. What's that? I wonder. Anyway, when done right, the dance is rather delectable, even though quite inexplainable. Get a load of these cats. They're solid. Yes, the jitterbug is the dance of modern youth. Why, even our piano player here is just a mere kid. Quit staring, herring. Okay, worm, let's squirm. And now the group precision jitterbug, in which the steps are executed on command, as was the custom in the old country square dance. Ready? Send out. And through. Shoulder twist, release. Tread switch. Drop. Solid. Now let's hit that jive. Solid. 